This is art. This is art. Art is an amazing program that the city uh, created uh, in 1959 to ensure that the city continues to provide public art, uh, especially in its neighborhoods. And so it's intended to provide public art that reflects the culture, the unique people, uh, and history of the city of Philadelphia. City funded projects like uh, rec centers, libraries, fire stations, any places where the budget is more than a million dollars. Um, that percent for art is triggered and that money is set aside. So when the city decides that it's going to do construction work on perhaps a, a library, uh, in this case at Pascoville, or a recreation center or a park, 1% of that budget has to go towards site-specific public art. So incorporating feedback from the community is a huge part of our process all the way through. Every percent for art project it starts with an open call, which is a, a public art competition for us to find the best artists who are uh, able to provide public artwork at the site. And so initially 35 artists applied. So we put together a committee of a variety of community members, stakeholders, library staff and users who actually are sort of the decision makers for Percent for Art. The Pascoville Percent for Art Committee selected Joshua Sarantitis as the winning artist. So I think that when people have command over the space that they live and they work, when they have a connection to the place through beauty and through creativity, uh, that's like an essential human right. And his design was really well received by the community. It was uh, very well received by the Percent for Art Committee. He's using mosaics which are just a beautiful and versatile material. One of the things that he heard about was that people would like different heights of seating that could accommodate children and adults, so that was a change that he made. Um, there were some elements that people were less excited about that he removed from his proposal. And what's really exciting is that he's going to be engaging and involving the community in actually creating the seats and creating the mosaics and learning this trade and learning this skill uh, along the way. I hope that a lot of people in that community who've never heard about Mosaic or never tried their hand at that will learn a new skill and maybe be inspired to continue making art. Wow.